What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. We're gonna be playing some Tekken 7 today. As you can see, my Brian is a Vanguard. We're gonna see if we can rank him up to uh, Warrior. I was a Warrior, I got demoted the other day. Oh shit, not good. And uh, so we're just trying to get back. So I play Tekken 7 uh, a lot. You know, I don't put it on the channel too much. I know I do a lot of Dark Souls, but you know, since I'm playing this game, you know, I've been picking it up a lot as lately. And uh, oh fuck, we're getting fucked up as I'm talking. I gotta shut up for a minute, hold on. Oh! Caught him. I don't like using the snake edge, dude. I know it. Can, you get punished a lot. Fuck. You get punished a lot at higher levels of snake edge. It's not, you know, a lot of people are like, oh, snake edge, snake edge, snake edge. Like, and when you get, if someone blocks your snake edge, dude, you're gonna get punished hard. This guy, man. Anyways, we're gonna see if we can get back to warrior and gold ranks. This dude is fucking us up. Let's focus up. There we go. Oh! Fuck! There we go. As I say, I don't like using snake guys, but whatever, he's not gonna block it. And I think we should take this. Boom! Anyways, guys, if you like Tekken 7, man, definitely uh, hit the subscribe button because I'm gonna be putting more Tekken uh, on the channel. This game is a really enjoyable fighting game for me, dude. I love it. Um, if any of you are looking to get into a fighting game, I would definitely recommend picking this up. Oh, I just dropped that combo so fucking hard. What am I doing? There we go. There we go. Big damage. Dude, we just wrecked him. And it's over. Good game. Good game. One more round and we take this. I'm gonna get that promotion, man. Shit. You're playing Brian, man. Guys, you have to utilize his uh, soccer kick and his hatchet kick. You have to. Which is quarter circle uh, backwards one and two. Or not one and two. Sorry, three and four. And good game. Got that promotion. All right. Good shit, man. Good game. Got a mirror match here. Round one. Let's see who's the better Brian. Look, we got the same effect and everything. Oh, caught him with the counter. So just forward, uh, forward three with Brian. If it catches as a counter, when he just he just raises his knee. It's just it's a good counter, man, but it comes out very slow. You know what I'm saying? Oh, he got us with the snake edge, you bitch. And we're against the wall, not good. As you guys know, back four against the wall will give you a free jet upper into big damage. So anytime you got someone's back on the wall, you hit them with back four. You get a uh, you know free. Jet upper, which is forward back. Forward back, uh, Oh, no! Fuck, dude. Oh, big damage. Good shit. God damn. This guy's a fighter. But look, we're back into the gold ranks. Back into the world of the gold. Oh, this guy's trying to hit me hardcore with that. Alright, let me focus up here. Here we go. If you see those kicks, you have to use those kicks. He just punched the fuck out of me. Why did I throw a goddamn snake edge out? I don't know, man. It's just kind of fucking instinctive sometimes, man. You know what you can do with the move, guys? I'm going to tell you this right now. Even at high ranks, the time you can use snake edge and it's effective is effectively using it as a counter. I just dropped that. I don't know why I didn't just hit fucking four after that. Jesus Christ. Anyways, you know, if someone's going to jab you, use it as a high crush. Then it's effective, you know, because they can't block it. Oh, goddamn. Got him. Puppies, you better knock it off. All right, here we go. I don't really like mirror matches, dude. You know, I, just for the fact of they know everything you're gonna throw out. I mean, yeah, if a person's first and they're using multiple characters, you know, they'll know, they'll know your moves anyways. But you know, obviously a mirror match, you're gonna know more than someone else who doesn't fucking main your guy. As you can see, I got my Brian looking all fucking cool as shit, like a robotic ninja. Fun fact, puppies. I am stop it. You really, you're gonna go kitchen. I'm gonna put you in there. You're gonna take a timeout. We're getting fucked up now because you're being bad. All right, here we go. Close one. Watch out. No! Oh, no. oh, tech it. Oh, hoo -hoo. hit him with the rage drive. Now I don't even remember what I was saying because my dogs wanted to be bad. Yeah, you are. Making daddy forget what he's talking about. All right, uh, I don't even know. Jesus, alright. Two knees! Dude, the wall damage of Brian is so so good. So good. We just took this shit back, dude. One more hit, it's over. There it is. Good game, bro. We are the better Brian. Alright, we got Noctis Column! 
So Noctis for me, guys. Oh my goodness. If you look at his combos, uh, I don't know how I feel. But I feel like he's a character that was made for people who, uh, you know, need someone that plays himself, essentially, to get into Tekken. Like, honestly, dude. You know, he has a finisher for his combos, which is, just, I believe, forward, forward, forward. And if, when you hit with a kick, you get, like, fucking five or six hits just for pressing the, that, that one command, dude. Like, for any other character, that'd be, like, you know... Four to five separate commands for that combo for that for as many hits as you get. Again, just forward, forward, B. And that right there, exactly. What he see what he just did to me right there. All he did was press forward, forward, B at the end of that combo, and he got all that fucking damage, dude. But too bad it's over. I'm gonna finish him like this. We didn't even have to, but I'm going to just because I don't like the goddamn character. Oh, that was weird. The screen glitched. You guys see that? It went like black behind Brian. Oh, oh, I remember what I was talking about now. Uh, back when my puppy started to be, uh, very bad. So, oh, snake, I just didn't get it with it. Uh, my Brian character, so you see, oh, we got lag. But I got the ninja star in the back, you can actually use that. If you press up, uh, one and three, he actually throws it across the screen. Now, they can sidestep and dodge it real easy. But it's kind of cool, it gives you a little projectile, you know what I mean? Also, I have the gun, I can also shoot him. I hate that move! It's such a cheap fucking move, dude. He's perfected us. That's fine. You see that move where Noctis throws his goddamn uh, knife? Like, dude, it just comes out so quick. It can hit you wherever you are on the stage. We're gonna go ahead and give him wall damage if he hits. Close. We're gonna do it to him anyways. Oh. <sighs> but again, Noctis is, uh, his combos are really easy, man. I don't know. This is... Whatever. It is what it is. I mean, if it brings more people to the game, it's a good thing for us, right? And, oh, he missed! He missed. Very nice. I feel like, uh, Brian, man, is... Oh, shit. You know, he's not that easy of a character to use, man. I feel like... And we just we just lost. God damn, we might lose this. It's this guy. It does have 75 wins. He's a warrior, so that means he doesn't lose too much. What's his name? Rock Shadow? There we go. Big damage. Big damage! Oh, we should have ended that. There we go! Oh, he's lucky he uses about to get the perfect. And then there's that move. And then there's that move. But yeah, when I win with Brian, I feel like it's uh, a lot of work, you know, once you're done. I mean, don't get me wrong, you can just smoke someone. His, he has a lot of power in his moves, but uh, I feel like nothing's really free. And you can be like, oh, but Snake Edge. No, like I said, dude, when, when Snake Edge at higher play will get blocked and you get punished. I would say 80% of the time, dude, and when you do get punished from trying to throw out a snake edge, you're going to receive, you know, a 50 to 60% damage combo, which is not going to make you too happy. Oh, God, this is close. Let me shut up. I want to focus up here. I don't want to lose this guy. Oh, it's over. Good night. Got him with the snake edge. Good game. Let's see if he wants it again. Right. We got a Yoshi player here. He has a promo chance. Let's see if we can stop it before it wins. God damn. Dude, some Yoshi players are just insane. Like, he has so many tricky moves. Anyways, yeah, back to Brian. So, I feel like, like I said, uh, his soccer kick and his hatch kick are so essential for him to winning, dude. Or, or at least being a good, decent Brian player. Um, you know, the hatchet kick, you can also combo. There's two different combos I know of. I'm sure there's a lot more than that off of it, but there's two that I usually do. Damn, he just fucked us up. God damn! Oh my god. I don't know why the hell I just tried to snake edge. That was shitty, shitty shit. But, you know, the quarter circle, uh, backwards, three and four, again. You know, if someone's on the ground, they'll always give you a free hatchet kick. That's quarter circle backwards, uh, four. And you know, while you're fighting, just to give a good low poke, you know, quarter circle back. Uh, three is essentially, you know, the the low... Oh, shit, that makes the, the awesome noise. Damn, this guy's fucking good right there. That was a soccer kick right there. That's the, uh, boom! Now, here's the combo I was talking about. Let's see if we can get it. You gotta you got make that, that dash. You saw me have to run, run, like, across the whole screen to get that under. But still, man, not bad. Shit. Oh, come on! God damn. I don't think we're gonna... This guy's gonna get promoed off us all day. Look at... Oh, all right. He just... I don't know. Brian doesn't have the best 
pressure moves. If someone's pressuring you like crazy, it's not that easy. He does have a parry, like, not the low parry, but it goes back uh, one and three at the same time. He does have a parry for high attacks. Oh, perfect, baby! Stuck against the wall and took him down. But, again, like, he doesn't have easy pokes. Because even though the execution for the two kicks for the hat trick in soccer, it's not the easiest thing to do in the world. You know, like, just to have a low kick, you have to do a quarter circle. Now, something I do, as a tip for you guys, like, if you're having a... Oh, fuck. If you're having a hard time getting those moves out or getting into his sway just by doing the, the quarter circle, do the full circle. So, I start with my finger pressing forward, and I do a full half circle backwards into either the hat trick. Gotcha! either into the hatchet or the soccer, and it makes it always come out consistently. Um, sometimes when I would be doing, you know, just the quarter circle, he would be doing different shit, and I couldn't hit it all the time. So it's just a little thing I do. I don't know, it might help you guys out, try it out. It, for some reason, the command just it seems to go. And we just took that! Oh my god, I thought we were going to lose. All right, we might bring this back. Stop this guy's promo, he's going to be pissed. Also, uh, 3 plus 4, very good uh, kind of keep away that Brian has. If it hits as a counter, it's going to be able to give you the charged 4-4-3. Four, four, there we go. But I think my Fury's definitely uh, improved, guys, from when I was, uh, you know, putting Tekken on the channel. What was it, maybe like two months ago? Door knocker! Oh, man, we might lose. I get so goddamn nervous playing this game. There we go. There we go! Soccer kicks, baby! Fuck! Why the fuck did I just snake edge? Oh my god! Oh shit! We got it. Good game, man. Oh my goodness. You win. Dude, that last match was Round skin of one. my goddamn teeth. Here we go. We got a Steve Fox here. Vindicator too. I believe that's two ranks above us. Oh shit, dude. Come on. Now this is what I was talking about, that pressure, you know what I'm saying? Like, look at this shit. I can't do fucking anything. I can do this. So a lot of people, guys, if you get into the gold ranks, there's a lot of people that just never stop pressing buttons, dude. You're gonna run into a lot of them. Uh, it's just spamming the fucking shit out of every move, like, in the book. Like, look at this guy, dude. Just never stops pressing buttons. And it's gonna work out into his advantage. Just... There we go! No, it's not. Caught him. Great. Jesus, but it's just, it's tough to deal with sometimes, man. Depending on the character, too. I mean, Steve can really fucking smother you, dude. What? You gotta watch out for the, uh, oh, there we go, caught him. Oh! <laughs> there we go. Try again with that back four. Give us a free jet upper. We gotta get him against a wall. Goddamn. Oh, that's what I was worried about, dude. I knew that was coming. Oh! Ho, ho, ho. Great. Took it. Good shit, dude. That was a nice sidestep. Round three. Fight. Oh, you little bitch. I love the noises this game makes when you hit, like, a counter and shit. It sounds like, you know, the, the biggest smack noise in the history of the world. There we go. Oh, I fucked that up. Should have went sidestep one. That right there. He's lucky he just armored, dude, because that would have been a launcher. That is... Oh, fuck. So we caught him out of the air with it. See, now he's just gonna... He was trying to smother us. And it's over. Good game, man. Alright, we got another Yoshi player here on a demo match. Fight. See, uh... That would be two people we've demoted this video. Let's see what happens. Oh, big damage, dude. That's the rainbow drop. Wait, is it? No, I don't know if it is. Dude, Yoshi had another grab in uh, previous second where he grabbed you and did like a backwards jump like he just did there, but he spun while he did it, and I know it did big fucking damage. Shit! There we go. Round two. I don't know. It's weird. If also too, I mean, you can use Snake Edge if you make your opponent just focus on, you know, throw out like, throw out a couple highs, a couple mids, a couple highs, and then right from the highs go low. It works sometimes. Like it's mindfuckery, dude. You gotta play mindfuckery in Tekken. You know, I feel like if you're always 
trying to be, you know, one step ahead of the move you're doing, and you get into that flow, then you'll just start doing great, you know what I mean? But if you're kind of stuck on thinking about the here and now, shit, dude, this guy got him. Oh, that's gonna hurt, buddy. Big damage, holy shit, dude. What? My hand was cl way closer to his body. That should have been us all day. Fight. Also, I'm going to be making a Souls video later too, guys. But uh, like I said, I just wanna, I'm going to start putting Tekken on the channel too. Like I said, I play the game, so why not? Why not? Why not just record it and have, have a good time, you know? There we go. Oh, I fucking just dropped that combo. God damn it. Because I'm talking. There we go. Oh, this guy does not block the snake I just said. Oh, holy shit. He's probably getting frustrated. My bad, man. I don't know. I know people hate it. I know they hate it. This guy, he's, he's gonna be pissed because we might demote him. Oh, he just dropped his combo, I believe. There we go. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> we just blasted him out there. There we go. The Ford Ford 4, man, with Brian. You guys play Brian, dude. You have to fucking utilize that move. So, also, we're going to make this the last fight of the video. I don't want this to be too long, but hopefully you guys, guys had a good time. Like I said, I think my Brian's improving. We get back into the gold ranks, so it's good shit. Oh, watch out! Let's see if we can end it with a win. And it's over. All right, man. Good game. And uh, we will see you guys later for a Dark Souls video. Peace.